Hello and welcome to episode 4 of Fappy. I'm gonna call the game Fappy now. Farmer Against Potatoes. This is a bridge episode between when we did our first challenge and all the way up to where we unlock cows. Next episode will be about cows. As promised today, we'll try every single class. We'll improve our gear by a lot and we'll make pretty good progress. I played every single day since last episode. Look at the gear on the left and at the end of the video I'll structure the ending of each episode a certain way from now on. You're gonna see the difference. Also the warm larva, I got three. That's it, right? Remember this too. Okay, so this is a new tab. I think it's level 500. So rock buff duration, eh, one day maybe. That gives you better gear. So I don't fully understand what this means. I don't care. It just means better gear. <laughs> this is nice because I get more of those larvae. I'm going to get that as much as I can. And this increases the base stats talent nodes. I will buy that also. I don't know when. Maybe now. I don't remember. Because there's a bunch of reincarnation in this episode, right? I will certainly buy this also to... Once again, I more or less understand the wording, but it gives you better gear and it's really clear. You'll see at the end of the video, as I said, and that's 15. I got 27 points and this is for materials. I never bought any of this yet. But if one day I have leftover points, I'll buy that. I don't feel like I need to buy that though. And as I talked about last episode, we're going to go with automation with these two things. Really going to help, but not at the beginning. I'm going to show it to you in a moment. But it automates buying potatoes and skulls, which is really nice. I can let it run in the background or whatever. But I don't even need to do that because it does it while the game is closed. So it's pretty good. So we'll grade that and then uh, increase the poop obtained from each worm. So that would double it, doesn't it? I think I get one, right? So then I would get two if I buy this. I will too. I just don't know when. So I got 11 points here, so I wasn't sure what to buy. I'm gonna go with this, I believe. Yeah, there you go. So, one point, so we're gonna wait for next reincarnation. At level 750, we'll have access to this. And we'll see it today also. That's how much progress we'll make. Yeah, I knock at that door, okay. Uh, those unique achievements, I'm gonna have to look them up. I probably missed some of them. I didn't show most of the ones that I have, didn't show them to you, but well, it's really easy, just look it up, maybe go on Discord and you'll find them all. When I go to a new area, I just try random things on buildings and the environment. Here you can tell, level 1500 eh, for the uh, previous class that I used, so it's a big jump cut, and nothing to show, it's just me killing potatoes, right? And I keep the game closed a lot also, so it took a day. Uh, okay, so now we have a new class. This is a class for um, crit. Very important for one of the challenges. I forgot to tell you, we're going to do challenges as well. Now I got 17 points. Decided to go with the double poop here. I only have five base Worms because I only did one challenge. You see those wheels? So when you start a reincarnation, the automation is not very useful, so it's better to go manually. But if I close the game for a while and I come back, everything stays up to date with the auto buy. So it's really fantastic. Makes my life so much easier. A great quality of life upgrade. Walk a potato, I'm going to show you the progress I made at the end of the video only. Okay, you've seen plenty of those uh, Walker Potato games for a bit. It's always the same thing, okay? And magically, almost 1600. Now we're ready for another reincarnation. And this one is for evasion. Very important for another challenge that we'll complete as well. I don't know why I clicked. I think I was just comparing uh, the growth per level because I'm still playing the game as I'm recording for myself, you know. There you go. And 
I have 26 points after this reincarnation, so we're gonna go with that. We're gonna get much better gear. And as a class, I can use the last class. I'm gonna concentrate on it to get even further better gear than I have right now. Somebody recommended that I do that. It's a very good idea and I will, but it will have to be next episode because I did get interrupted by the cows in this episode. So we're starting to see some of the gear. So this is a better weapon. I have a little bit of uh, tier 4 refined, uh, it's called, oh, it's the quality is called refined, yeah. Tier 4 uh, mats and the boost, I can also enchant this and equip it. So we're starting to make progress in terms of gear. And I can ditch the rest. And I can probably, oh, I accidentally locked it. Yeah, if you hold the button, which button is it? I don't remember. <laughs> Anyways, you can lock it so it doesn't get deleted when you auto-delete. And I'll show probably that I know that button now. Here, I was just checking the others. I didn't care about the rest. And look at that. You can, with one button, eliminate everything. All right. So where are we going? 1666. Okay, so I'm done. I'm done. So this is the class I'm pointing to. Next class. This class is drop chance and drop cap max increase. So it's the perfect class to farm for gear. But that's not my goal today. My goal was just to touch every class once and then do challenges and accidentally unlock cows. But my plan was to, uh, after having done every single class, go back to this class. I forgot the name, the one I'm in right now that gives better gear. To really buff up my gear nicely. So I'm buying this. I prefer getting those uh, because of the leaderboards, I guess. And all level 1500. But now I want to do challenges. Now people encourage me to do challenges. I already intended to do the two ones that are Neo and Double Dragon. Neo is for evasion, Double Dragon is for crit. Okay, so. Here, I have to evade to be able to hit mobs. So it's not very difficult because I chose the right class for this. And then, uh, unfortunately, I'm not gonna show you my evasion chance, but it was really high, maybe 40% or close enough. So 40% of the time I get to hit the mobs. That was after I bought a bunch of upgrades in the tree, such as, that's the one I'm looking for right there, evade chance that agility provides okay so i'm gonna buy that and uh in a moment i'll show you there you go so my tree okay looks like this and i got a bunch of those uh, increase evade chance and i'm looking for more and more and more and uh, honestly it's not a difficult challenge at all so long as you focus on those that i'm pointing at the little feather looking thing okay very easy. It will be the same for the other challenge also uh, about crit. Same principle. And yeah, the rewards are really generous for challenges. And here we're about to finish it. We need 1950. There you go. Very smooth. Very smooth. And we get the Steam achievement. I'm gonna have to check what percentage of Steam achievement I got. Look at these beautiful uh, rewards. Right? It's pretty nice. You can pause and if you want to see exactly what they are. So we got 12 points here. We're going to max out this um, larva chance, larva drop chance. And that's what I want right there, that uh, one that I just chose here. Okay, I still don't have level 750. I'm getting there, but it's going to take some time because um, normally I would, I don't remember if I stretch this run like uh, this uh, reincarnation or if i went straight to the challenge i don't remember i'm not gonna get too many points if i reincarnate right away so here we're gonna get better gear so i have no point left double dragon is the next one maybe i stretched it because yeah i'm gonna cut to the point where it's already done i'm not even gonna show you anything 
Okay, so I did stretch it. Look, I'm at 2, 8, and 9. But I'm past double dragon. Yeah, see? Level 2000, so I stayed there. Then I went with this last, critical chance and critical cap. No, I'm gonna start double dragon now, never mind. <laughs> Got confused with footage, sorry about that. Still, so I did stretch it, as I should have, to get a better reward in terms of uh, reincarnation uh, points. So I can attribute them to get stronger. Now it says 99 plus, I got 100 and something every time I reincarnate. Real nice. So now what I'm looking for is, I'm about to point to it. What I'm looking for is those. Increased critical chance that Dex provides. So only thing that, that hurt mobs is crit. And once again, I forgot my crit chance on this. Well, all you have to do is look for increased crit chance, use this class whatever it's called, <laughs> and uh, you get it easily. I think after one round, I don't know, I don't want to give advice or uh, tips. This is not a guide. But anyway, you see big jump here. Uh, double dragon is done. I didn't need to show you the whole pop-up and everything. But yeah, so we reach almost 2000 with this. In fact, I don't think we I don't think we pushed uh, with this class because we were already 1900 something, were we not? And look at these larva. Remember I had almost nothing at the beginning of the video. I'll get even more in this. 177 worms right now. It's gonna go up also. Adventurer! I said, oh, with all the equipment, this looks hard. Not hard at all. Of course, at this point, maybe if I did it earlier, it would have been tougher. So I still have my gear. Well, I'll find out that it gives nothing. That's what it says anyways. We have a new helmet. It's enchanted. I'm a bit conservative on the enchantments for now. Because all this gear gets replaced all the time. Maybe eventually I'll spend some more, I don't know. Well, I want five levels. I want it to be zero, yeah, for uh, the main stat. I didn't want to lose any of the main stats. So here, uh, you see the window on the top is empty. I get no bonuses at all from gear. Doesn't matter, very easily I completed this. No problem at all. Nice. So that's another challenge done. It means that I get to start with worms right away, more and more. And I wanted to do more challenges than this, so I got all these four done, right? So greedy I wanted to do it, and the blind. But first I wanted to get better gear, so I wanted to use the class on the bottom right at 1534. Sorry, I don't know the name of the class yet. This reincarnation is still going, but where I'm confused is why I have 32 points. Oh, that's because I saved them. So this is for milk. Also for milk, yeah, save them. That's what happened. Uh, this is, um, uh, I don't know what it is. You can pause if you want. <laughs> Sorry about that. I don't know. And uh, multiply class XP. That's really interesting. But again, the gear, the gear. So I'm gonna go with that. And more gear here. So yeah, um, once I got what I wanted on the other page, I started. I started uh, saving points. That's why I had so many points because it didn't make any sense. I didn't reincarnate. I'm still in the same reincarnation as the challenge I just did. And I want this to more class XP. I got six points. Only cost one, you know. Pretty cheap. Look at that bonus, almost 100%. That's pretty good. So I'm going to go with that, but I'm going to buy. Cow upgrades next episode, obviously, now that I have access to it right here. This happened today, by the way. So when this happened, I didn't know when I would unlock cows, but well, we just did. So I started recording when I saw that. That's after um, being offline, right? So I'm going to click on it, but we're not going to look at it in any detail. We'll figure it out later. But it does cost 1,000 worms to get one cow. I got 513. So my goal 
Okay, my goal is to farm worms. I'm going to stress <laughs> 2.4 million poo. I'll take care of it on my own without showing to you. But uh, look, one hour, 50 worms. Okay, so I'm going to stretch this reincarnation just so I can artificially get access to cows. So I can show you the mechanics and understand them myself. And then after that, I'll go back to playing normally. Okay, so whack a potato. This is the progress that we made so far. Okay, I play it once in a while. Sometimes I skip it. 39 out of 1000. Ouch. And I made the buffs a little better. Just one level for the cheaper ones. This one also. Maybe not this one. I'm not sure. Anyways. And uh, I got one slot. You know. So every video I'll make progress on Waka Potato. At the end of each video. I'll show you that. In fact. I think I'll keep this format for every video. I might make some adjustments. So I just showed you that. Then I'll show you uh, my uh, warm larva. I got my first warm silk. I just noticed it. Nice. That's just a vanity thing, the warm silk for now, but eventually it will be uh, something that will be part of the game, give you some benefits other than just the uh, leaderboard, which I have nothing to show for for now. And these are my level for each classes. And uh, as I said, I'll stretch this run 103 points if I reincarnate now, but I don't want to. And this is my gear. Look at that. Exquisite Adventurer Meteor Knight Shoes. Very long name. Reminds me of World of Warcraft. And uh, that's my gear. And I don't know if you're interested in the level of each, but oh yeah. And we're going to switch skins. Look at this. Looks nice. I also unlocked this, but it looks pretty bad. <laughs> so I'm going to go with uh, this one, which was unlocked accidentally. And they will get all unlocked eventually. And there's a, the blind challenge will give me another skin. Anyways, I'll stick with that for now. Okay. And uh, one last thing is if you're interested in the level of each piece of gear, 11,000, 12, 10,000. So it's all five digit now. Okay. And we'll get even better in the future. All right. So next episode will be about cows. Okay. I don't know how much I can explore uh, of this new mechanic, but at least we'll look at it as much as possible. And I want to really increase that class that gives better gear. I hope you like this video. If you did, please hit thumbs up and leave a comment below. If you want to support this channel, you can subscribe and hit the notification bell to make sure you don't miss future videos. Thank you for watching and see you next time.